Swiss voters headed to the polls to vote in a dual referendum on food sovereignty and production standards. The sovereignty proposal has been put forward by farmers and supported by the country's left of center political parties. It is aimed at protecting small farm farmers. Uh, meanwhile, uh, the second vote focuses on the Fair Food Initiative, which has campaigned for sustainable production methods for all food products sold in Switzerland, whether imported or homegrown. Three farm businesses close every day with farmers facing uh, fiercer competition from industrial agriculture and cheaper imported produce. It is absolutely indispensable that the la que, que les paysans subsistent en Suisse, qu'ils puissent vivre, qu'ils puissent vivre bien euh, de ce qu'ils font et pas comme aujourd'hui euh, d'assister par exemple à des suicides, à des, à des faillites, à des choses comme ça. Et puis que nous consommateurs, euh, on soit encouragés dans notre démarche d'acheter local, de manger local le plus possible et puis d'avoir des produits de bonne qualité, sains et... Voilà, pour moi, c'est l'essentiel. Producers also demand that the government guarantee that farmers can sell their products at fair prices, promote direct sales and ensure more price transparency to help farmers negotiate with retailers and food processors. The Swiss government has called the initiatives dangerous, quote-unquote, saying that they would send food prices skyrocketing and uh, could trigger tariff increases, hurt the economy as well.